Hi, I'm Josh Ebner. Welcome to the PSEG Long Island Home Comfort Whole House Residential Heat Load Calculations Training Series. As a Home Comfort Partner, you'll find this series an invaluable guide for properly sizing and selecting mechanical equipment for participation in the Home Comfort Program. In this segment, we'll be reviewing the purpose and value of performing accurate load calculations. I'm excited to present on this topic because it's a topic I get a lot of questions about. Manual J load calculations is really the first step in designing any HVAC installation. And it's probably the most important for the life of the system and the quality uh, of comfort of the occupants. So you'll see here on my slide, you have the my contact information if you need to get a hold of me. I'd be happy to answer all kinds of questions. General energy use for a home, heating and cooling, if you add water heating in there, adds, adds up to about 60%. So it's important that we calculate exactly how much heat flows in and out of a house. Uh, it's a pretty simple formula for the heat flow, but you can imagine there's a lot of different components to a house. So the Magnet J load calculation is really gonna take all those inputs, runs it through a calculator, and tells us on our design days what BTU we need to heat uh, and cool that house. Improper sizing is is very detrimental to energy consumption, especially during times of peak demand. Uh, it leads to, on the cooling side, uh, lack of dehumidification, uh, short run times. On the heat pump heating side, you're again gonna be short cycling. Occupant comfort really gets uh, lowered. There is a, a paper version of ACA's Manual J load calculation. It's just a guidebook because there is a lot of inputs and there's a lot to know in the software. Uh, if you guys wanted to pick up this Manual J load calculation design book, you can see it. Uh, it's on Amazon. I have a, a little photo of a plan there and the, and the plans when you're out in the field don't need to be as exact as this drawing here. You can get rough sketches. You, you want to get rough room sizes. The windows are important. The orientation of the house is important. You want to make sure you're checking the the window jams and the door jams to determine if it's two by four, two by six, or two by eight construction. Uh, the year the house is built tells you a lot of information as well. Thanks for watching. To see this whole series and to access additional helpful program content, be sure to visit us often at psegliny.com.